It's time. Hold on. I need to change to the thing. Give it a moment. There it is. <laughs> I should probably set this to studio mode whenever, whenever I need to change over. But I, I've, I'm, I'm working on my little update in my Discord server. Like, yay, we finally hit 30 follows. Let's go. Sneep snorp. So before before this, like, like I'd say like four hours before stream today, I took. Oh, I just remembered. I um, this is from before I killed that goblin. That's for me. I, I have an exam today, and it's split into, like, I think eight parts. And I did, like, the first third. I did I did parts A through C. I'm putting on my slippers. Where is you? Where are you? Where are you? I think he came from somewhere this way. There's a guy. You know what? It's not worth it. I remember that goblin never has anything on it. But anyway, actually, I kind of want to just keep farting around. So, anyway, I will not be streaming for too long today. Oh, probably, uh... Oh, I remember now. I did turn down the brightness on my second monitor, so that's why it's so dark for me. Yeah, today's stream won't be very long because it sees me. I know you don't see me. It's probably like a slaughterfish or something. Yeah. so worried about no one being able to see shit when it was just me that couldn't see shit. <laughs> I think this cave is important to a quest. So we might leave. Probably kill the closer ones first. Ah, shit! Here we go. Nice, nice, nice. There's an imp body. 
Well, I keep burping. I had chips before I streamed. But I also took a nap because I was very, very sleepy. That's why I didn't do all of the exam that I have today. And it's histology. Oh shit! Where? Oh, that's like super far ahead. And I should probably explain what histology is because every time I've brought it up, no one has known what the subject was. But to be fair, whenever I first took it um, last year, I didn't know what it meant either. <laughs> it's the study of um, small tissues and cells. And, uh,. So we have like specific lab exams as well as lecture exams. The lab exams are easy and that's what the first exam is, is a lab exam. And I think there's six exams total in this class. And I have taken this before. I have taken this class before, but I got a really bad grade on it. I didn't fail, but it, my grade wasn't very good and I need to bring my minor GPA up. Because I'm a biology minor, and I did not know that apparently, like you, oops, get back in there. Our boy Snape Snorp and his adventures. Do not call for third person perspective. But yeah, my, my minor GPA is counted separately. Like, I thought it was GPA overall that I need to have good, but like, in order to um, graduate, I need to have like a certain GPA for everything. So many skeletons. It's hard to tell them all apart, to be honest. And because I've taken this class before, you must be thinking, Oh, Samuel, you've taken this before, so like, you're good at it, right? You like, remember stuff from it, right? No, I do not. I blocked that shit out of my memory. Bad class. I don't like it. Is it? Hold on a moment. Is this it? It's not. There's more passages that I missed. But anyway, I was thinking about the images and like, honestly, the lab exams are much better than the lecture exams because there's images. I mean, there's some images in um, lecture exams as well, but they're not as interesting. They're not like, oh, oh, ooh. Message. Edwys Cave. He didn't like. Oh yeah, I remember this. I remember this now. I didn't remember the rocks though. Shit. No, quit moving. the little guy is so shredded. I remember being like uh like 10 years old and just being like 
Why? Why are, why are these tiny creatures ripped? I just always found it funny. Representation for all the short kings out there. Oh, <laughs> that's a bad joke. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, but it's just. No, oh, actually. Come on. actually would be better than what I have right now. <laughs> I look a little silly, but hey, that's pretty nice. I get six points of armor. Light armor. And I don't know if it has like durability like other things do. That working on your armor or scale is pretty important. Because eventually, I think it's a journeyman of armor where you get uh, the ability to um, repair enchanted things so you don't have to take them to the town. You don't have to go to a town for anything. Experience means free shit. And actually, I got a tome. I can drop you. Hasty translation is scrolled here. Fourth star hour time. Terror of the most terror of Meridia come. Okay. I remember this. Actually, if I kill this one first... That doesn't matter, I guess. <laughs> Where are you going? Well, I can't kill you if you go that way. Oh! I can. Wherever this guy is. Where? Where are you? There you are. Hi. Shit.
Nice try, but I know the weakness of magic. It's scooching a little bit to the left. Things keep activating. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about it. I just barely see you over there. There we go. Oh. The scholar! I don't know what that is. But I shall look at it. Oh, and there's swords everywhere. Stone settlers, builders, not rest, like Meridia, terror of the most terror, haste to save home. Interesting. I honestly don't really remember this little cave very much. But I do think it's interesting that paths, paths, paths and passages keep opening up for us. was before. Hold on. I don't get it. Do I just wait till the fourth hour? You know, I'm good at math, but when it comes to time, my brain just short circuits. I don't know if that really does anything in terms of whatever these mean. What if I wait till 4 a.m.? <laughs> How are you doing today? I'm doing good. I won't be streaming for very long, but but that's because I have an exam. I already did like half of it, so I'm fully aware of my exam. I'll probably stream for like an hour and a half, like I did yesterday. It's histology. I need to do it before 10 p.m. It's currently 6.19. So I know I got time, but like... I still want to, like, make sure I can take it. I need to go this way. We hit our goal yesterday, and I'm super happy about it. I didn't have anything super specific in mind for the next goal, but I do know that I will, um, once we hit this new goal, um, I will possibly be eligible for affiliate, which would be really nice. Because not only would I get monies, but you guys would get more things to mess with. Like, like, emotes and, 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 uh, points. 
I don't know what else. I'll need to I'll need to like learn more about that stuff from the creator's end. There's another passage. What? But yeah, I took the first three parts of that exam. For some reason, this teacher splits them into like eight parts, even though it's not that big of an exam. So it's very tedious and and stupid because we have to use um, Respondus Lockdown. And you have to you have to start up a new session of Respondus after each exam and those parts all count as separate exams. And it sucks! Because there's a webcam check and I have to like do tests and verify my identity, so I have to do that eight times. It's awful. I'm glad my other biology class isn't doing anything like that. Because that system just is awful and I hate it. And I know it's like an anti-cheat software, which is... Which is nice for the teachers, but like... Don't split your kind of like average sized exam into eight parts. You could split it into like four or even three. Make like each part for like the different chapters. <laughs> Just make the, the amount of parts equivalent to the amount of chapters that are involved. So not only would it be easier to study for the exam, but it would just be um, easier and like not as like draining to take the exam in terms of like oh hi. It'd just be easier in terms of verification and anti-cheat software, so you wouldn't have to do eight different sessions. I see you. Back at the fort for a sec. Alright, so I have plans for this playthrough. I kind of want to just... Yeah, that's right. We need to go to the west. I have plans for this playthrough. It's very easy to just, like... Just use fast travel as often as possible. Especially for reaching cities, because you can already fast travel to them. But, I kind of want to just not do that. And just, um, instead, just walk by foot to certain places. And once we've reached them ourselves, then we can fast travel if we want. Because eventually running around like this is going to be a bit draining, especially with like bandits and such. But I think I kind of want to do a bit of the main quest line. I'm going to do my favorite um, space to Puma. Should probably just go through the Imperial City. Then we can, after after we start um, the main quest line a little bit, I want to do my favorite quest line. The Dark Brotherhood quest line. So good. So good. And pretty easy too. We get some really good armor out of it. 
It's especially nice, like, early in-game. Recovered a sprig of nerd root plant ingredient that this unusual must have value. So you should bring it to an alchemist to find out a little more about it. Alchemists can be found in almost every city in Cyrodiil. I have never done the nerd root quest line actually. I don't know how like, how long it is or like I think you have to collect like twenty sprigs of nerd root. It's definitely very alchemy oriented. Might be worth looking into actually. Hit me up. I think this is the prison. Yeah, there's the main city. taking two biologies this semester which is all right but like i realized it's my 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 other biology class is really nice because forensics is like really easy actually let's see let's do the nerd root quest line Where's the closest one, actually? Let me see. Oh, there's two in here! Everybody needs a copy of the Black Horse Courier! Have a copy of the Black Horse Courier! The Grey Fox! I might- I might do the... Thieves Guild questline later. I'd rather get more... Uh, stuff. Finally, a new customer. Please, look around. Just promise me you won't buy from that fetcher, Thoranir. Oh, I forgot about Thoranir as well. How interesting. I've heard of these glowing roots, but never had the fortune of seeing one. Unfortunately, I know nothing about them. Yeah. You want to speak to Sindarian of Skingrad. He's an alchemist over there who specializes in unusual plants, fungi, and roots. Good to know. Tell me about Thornier. I cringe whenever that name is mentioned. <laughs> his inventory has to be stolen or something because his prices are so low. They're below my cost. At this rate, I don't know if I can keep my doors open. All the people are spending their money there. Bah! <laughs> if you want to help out some poor merchants, head on over to Jensen's Good as New merchandise. She'll fill you in with the details. Jensen is running the show. She will get in, but good. Goodbye. Thank you. Actually, what do you have for if sale? You have it we'll see. But I went to persuade you first. Yeah, I know how to persuade people. You know, on the PS3 version, I never I, once found I I could say that. anybody you, oh, that um, actually enjoyed boasting. What a wonderful! I wish get a, but I keep so? finding people on the Steam version that do. I guess maybe they wanted to up the variety a little bit. Really? Interesting. Not funny. Oh, please! What a wonderful! What? No. You're wasting your breath. Yeah, yeah, whatever. No, you do. Really? Ugh, that's. You're wasting your breath. Best, best. I wish most I could fun. say that. Ugh. What? That's just <laughs> talk. Thank you. Have a look at my wares. To me. I'm uh. sure there's something to suit you. Wait, hold on. No, 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 no. Haggle. We have to haggle first. 
I usually put it around there. I wouldn't make that deal. A bargain at a Give me your things. Yes. You can buy all of my ale. And you can buy my poisons too. They are very heavy. You've made a good That's more than Catastrophe. That's a good deal. You got a great an excellent bargain. We poison of fumbling. A good price for a good customer. Let's see. How much rat meat do I have? I could sell you like half of that. You don't buy anything else. Tell your friends about me. Be seeing you. Bye bye. I hope it's not too late. Or I suppose actually it's a bit early because I forgot I had done the time stuff. I'd mess with the time to see if something would happen. Feel free to browse, friend. It's nice to see a new shopper. I was afraid I lost any hope of new business ever since Thorinir opened up. Tell me about Thorinir. So, Ogier sent you, hmm? Well then, he usually sizes up people well, so you may be just what we're looking for. Start from the beginning. I'm the chairperson for the Society of Concerned Merchants. We formed this group a while back to keep a nice, fair economic balance in town. Not every store is a member, but we're slowly trying to convince them to join. Everything was fine until Thorinir opened his shop nearby. Selling all sorts of merchandise, he undercuts prices like you wouldn't believe. He doesn't always sell what we sell, but it is still a problem. People who buy tend to want to spend their money there. That leaves none for us. It's getting so bad, a few of us may have to close up shop. He outright refuses to join the society or even discuss the matter. We are convinced he's up to no good. What we need is for you to case his establishment and figure out where he gets his inventory. Find some proof of his wrongdoing and let us know. We cannot do it ourselves, as he recognizes all of us. The job pays a fair bounty in gold when he is brought to justice. All right, then. Thank you. Thanks again for your help. We had no other place to turn. You know what? Since uh, the nerd request is in Skingrad, let's let's do this. I look like a bandit with my fancy shirt. Like I'm pretty sure I've seen bandits wear my exact fit before. Hey there. So what you're kind of deal you. can I make for you today? I don't know that anyone in Cyrodiil drives a harder bargain than Palaniria at Divine Elegance. Hmm. We'll see. Oh. You like admiration and coercion. Really? Right. Now. I you're a Shit. I doubt it. Please, I'm embarrassed. I doubt it. Not funny. Not even a little bit. <laughs> Get away from me. Re uh, you win this one. I can't. Uh, you. I doubt it. All right, then. I have the best prices in town. Why? I'm smart. And you're smart. We know the right people, we get the best deals. Inventory. What about my inventory? Very nice selection, Thorin here. 
Well, thank you. It's not only a fine assortment of goods, but a bit of a treasure trove. You never know what I'll have in stock. I can see by the look on your face, you wonder where I get all these fantastic items. I'll tell you what I tell everyone else who asks. It's all about who you know. My sources are good, but they are secret. Anyway, have fun looking around, and when you are ready to buy, give me a shout. Hmm. I so I can't have a look do around. anything else. You won't find better prices in all God. Tamriel. Boom! You're right. Your prices are good. Maybe. Yeah, they're pretty cheap. What would you buy my stuff for? Pretty good. So I should be able to put this around here. A fine transaction. No, I want to keep that for now. I think. Maybe. I don't need that. I'm an Argonian. I naturally resist diseases. Come back and s goodbye. Hope to see you again very soon. Hold on a minute. What's up here? Oh, the arrow is pointing at him. I'm sorry. I'll leave. But wait, hold on. Speaking to Thornier hasn't revealed any information. Since he's obviously hiding something, I should keep an eye on him. I'll watch what he does after his shop closes. Ooh, good point. When does your shop close? Oopsie. Hey, okay, what time is it? Yeah, let's wait. What is it, Sid? Where are you? There's so many people here. How are you? I see you. Hello. <laughs> How do you do? I'm not sure what they're doing. I see you. Hello. They say that the priests and priestesses of the Chapel of Debella have Greetings. all been I'm never to their what can I do no one even knows who Have you ever met anyone Goodbye. who barters better than Paloneria? Oh, She's the best love. in the city. And they say that when you murder someone, you the Dark Brother comes to you in your sleep. It's how they the recruit bodies. new members. I understand Daedra worship has no become idea. increasingly prevalent Indeed. in the Somerset Isles. Have you heard any word about the other it provinces? Seems Somerset Isles Rumor has it the Nerevarine has left Marlin on an expedition to Ireland. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. And has not been heard from since. It's not surprising considering Morrowind's violent past. We can only hope the troubles subside quickly. Good day. Hi there. A lot of mages swear by Hello again. Staffs. Greetings to you. Rindir always Hi keeps up fine. Hey, I don't know that anyone in Cyril drives a harder bargain than Palinir at Divine. Why are you following me? Blasted thief. I'm not following you. I saw him. You ignore me. Then I didn't. How about it's that? The best I'm not here. For I alchemical see. Don't look at me like that. I hear you. Have you heard any word about the other provinces? Nothing I'd like to talk about. But what Good is he doing? Heard any news from the other provinces? 
I have heard things are bad in Vardenfell. The Telvanni do their best to close the gates, but it is to no avail. This is unbelievable. How can the gods let this happen? Good day. Maybe I waited too long. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I need to hide. I don't know, it just says follow him, so I have like no real oopsie. No reason to How goes it? What can I do for you? I have no real reason to worry about sneaking, I guess. I don't know what to do. Roslin and Loronk are going around saying that some of the Imperial Watch are corrupt. Where's this man going? Oh, hi. Can't see me, I'm behind a tree. Right. What are they doing though? Arcade sewers. How do I not know about this? But what are they up to? They haven't done anything. There's more people. That's why. That's why they weren't doing anything. Well, maybe. No, what are you doing? That you, oh. <laughs> Shh! Not so loud. How many times have I told you that? Sorry. I am not used to this kind of meeting. It always makes me nervous. Well, just shut up and listen to me. The next shipment will be sooner than I expected. Just have the money ready. Same assortment of things? I mean, I have enough clothing for now. You take what I get. I get notice at the last second, and I have to jump on it. No time to be picky about it. Well, that society is putting more pressure on me, so maybe we better cut back for a while. You cut back now, and I'm going to take my business elsewhere. Or maybe pay a visit to that Jen scene and tell her about your little scheme. Fine. You made your point. Contact me when you have the items, and we'll meet again. Don't worry. 
It'll be very soon. Now get out of here. Unfriendly competition. I've observed a meeting between Thornier and a mysterious man named Argamir. Looks like my new target is Argamir. Should follow him and see where he goes. Hello again. Hey. I love how like they don't even really care. They're just like, oh yeah, this random person was listening. Whatever, it's fine. me hurry up I'm so impatient where are you even going Pleasure. Hey, what is it, citizen? Nothing. I know there's a guy here that buys like alien stuff. I think it's this guy. Curious where this guy's going. Oh. Argamir has a house in Tevis Plaza. I should go inside when he's not around and investigate. So probably. Probably around the same time, possibly. I'm not sure. Actually, he might be out during the day, so I think it'd be worth a wait. Oh, good to know. All right, then. Then I shall wait. I'll wait till then. He's still home. I could probably wait till around midnight. That's so boring. God damn it. I 
don't like this this quest very much. Let's just try every three hours. See what works. What is this dude a shut in or something? Come on. Come out! I want to be let in! There he is. Oh wait, who's this guy? <laughs> Where did he come from? Also, who are you? Well, you you are in fancy schmancy I'm robes. Just Bannon, retired. Sleep late and read trashy books. I don't keep up with the Major's Guild affairs anymore. Nice tan. I spent 40 years at the Arcane University. Good years, but I don't miss it. Now I'm completely useless and proud of it. <laughs> Honestly, that does sound nice. Just being old and useless, but also getting to enjoy the end of your life. It sounds real nice. This guy! I swear. He'll probably leave when his shipment arrives. to go up or down. Seems I have to go down. Whoa! Found my way into Argmir's basement. This place consists of an odd assortment of clothing and trinkets. Most disturbing is the dirty shovel and mud crusted boots tucked into the corner and the bits of ground bone meal strewn about. Excuse me. I suspect Argamir's stock he sells to Thorneer is taken from the recently dead. I should continue to search carefully for more solid evidence into this grisly accusation. The Cobb Manifest. Found a manifest that seems to detail names of the recently deceased. What they were buried with and their locations in Cyrodiil. You should take this macabre manifest and confront Thorinir, as he may not realize where his merchandise com is coming from. It would explain why he's a bit picky and greedy, because he just he just doesn't know. and bone meal. I won't steal anything until I start the Thieves Guild quest line because it's just not really worth it. No wonder he keeps his home barred. <gasps> Ooh, you know what I want to do? Before before I leave today, after I do whatever, however long this quest is, after I do this, I want to do the arena. The arena is always super fun. Oh, hi! All visitors to the Imperial Palace are asked to keep their hands down. Yeah, 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 blah, blah, blah. I'm I'm here to cause problems on purpose. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Oh, he's back in his place. Hey there, buddy. 
Welcome back. I can't believe what I'm seeing in this book. I'm mortified to think these things here were once on the bodies of the recently deceased. It's just too horrible to comprehend. I don't even know what to say. I, I guess an apology is not enough. What can I do? Help me catch Argamir. Yes, Argamir. that's the least I can do. First and foremost, I will never meet with him again. I can promise you that. Secondly, I remember him mentioning a place he had to be this very day. Hmm, yes, that's right. He said that he wouldn't be able to do anything else, as he had something important to do. You don't think he would dig up another... Oh, no, he wouldn't. But I guess he has been. Oh, my. What have I done? Aww. Poor guy who's accused of being an awful guy, and it's just, like, some guy that he was buying from that was being awful to him. Don't worry. I'll stop him. Yes, you do that. And in the meantime, I'll decide what to do with all these ill-gotten things. I'm so sorry. Oh. Poor guy. He got accused of being like a thief and a terrible person, but he's not. He, he was also a victim in this whole thing, just not financially. I hope everyone can forgive me for not doing a better job checking up on my sources. Sometimes things are too good to be true. I hope you can forgive me. I had no idea. I think it would help if he like donated some of his awesome funds to the other businesses around. Any of the businesses in that in that group. I think it would just make forgiveness come by a bit easier. Notice that the door to the Trent Trentius family mausoleum has been unsealed. This must be Argamir's doing. I should proceed inside. Should I just kill them? I mean, it looks like he's prepared for that. I guess so. Whoa! I have started the Dark Brotherhood quest line. Located at Argamir inside the Trentius family mausoleum, it appears as though he's attempting to desecrate another grave along with someone else I don't recognize. I can't convince him. Well, it's a bit late for that. Argamir has been slain. Since the penalty for grave robbing is death, it somehow seems as though justice has been done. I should search the gravesite for anything potentially incriminating. They looked ready for fighting anyway, so I'm kinda glad I did that. It's this guy. I'm stealing your shit. Oh. Ooh, I can sell that. Yeah. Gimme, give gimme. Yeah, it looks like they were busy with that guy in the center. Don't really know what else to do. See if I can move their bodies. I don't remember which button it was, but... Which button was it? Hold on.
Is it just... No. It's not. And remember... I thought it may have been like shift or control, but no. I don't remember which button it was. I've done this before. Why do I not remember the button? Or they think they may be laying on top of something. Oops. New. Okay, there's Argamir shovel. Oh! Required Argamir shovel. Still damp with the fresh earth of the open grave. This is the final bit of proof I need of Argamir's crimes. I should bring it back to Thorinir. So I have technically started the Dark Brotherhood questline. I remember what I used to do was I would go to the camp below Kavach. And I would go into one of the tents and wait for the guy that stays in that tent to go to sleep and then I'd kill him. And then I'd just sleep in his little bedroll. It's like the easiest way to start that one, but sometimes you just come across it in different ways. Well met. What oh my god, there's so many people. This hey, you. Surprise. Yes? Not you. Not you. Go away. Anytime. Take care. Were you able to stop Argomir? Yes, here is his shovel. Then we can at last rest. I feared had he somehow bested you, I'd be next. It is fortunate that your skills exceeded his. Oh, he didn't I've really see it to coming. Some decisions. I intend to donate all of the money I have made, yeah. as well as what is left of these stolen items, to the temple. I also want you to know that I had a long discussion with Jen Seen, and I have decided to join the society. I realize you risked your life to give me a chance, and Thorinir never forgets things like that. Accept this ring as a humble reward. Nice. It's the least I can do to say thank you. Now, don't be a stranger. The copious coin purse is still in business. Thank you. You've shown me mercy. I won't forget that. Oh, thank you. Hello. Yay! What is it, citizen? Yeah, I'm assuming I have to go, like, talk to... ...the others. And be like, hey! Whoa! Yes? You seem... I have been anxiously awaiting your return. Taken from the, the very dead. thought of what Agarmir was doing sickens me. I hope those poor souls rest in peace now that this is over. Yeah. Sword here. Well done. This shovel will certainly confirm Agarmir's crimes. Along with the manifest, it should prove useful to the City Watch. In your absence, Thornir visited, and we spoke at length about his role in this scheme. I believe him when he says he didn't know Agarmir's sources. He told me of his intentions to donate all of the money and inventory to the local temple. He also agreed to buy and sell merchandise at fair prices. Last but not least, he's officially joined the society. I am taken aback by his honest intentions. In return, the Society has decided not to press charges. His name will be absconded from the records of this crime. Now, Good. He I'm was a sure sweet guy. you are waiting to hear about your reward. The Society thanks you for everything you have done. Please, take this gold. <gasps> Money! Many thanks on behalf of all of us. Thank you! I'm mature enough to admit I was mistaken about Thorinair. He's a welcome member of our group in the Market District. Yeah! Alright, bye-bye. It's been a pleasure doing business with you.
What's your story? All right, then. That was quick. Quick and easy. All right, which way is the arena? Hold on. Arena. Oh, I'm facing it, actually. That would be nice. Arena! You know, I've been doing a bit of research. I went, I went around the wrong side. I've been doing a bit of research on um, the general, like, story and and general lore with the um, the Elder Scrolls series. And I learned by looking at the wiki page that um, Number six is going to be. What is it? Um, I don't know who you are. Possibly the last you've got Elder Scrolls game. Ten seconds to tell me what you're doing in my blood works before I lop your arms off. I want to be a combatant. You what? You want to be a combatant? <laughs> Look at you! My granny could beat you, and she's dead. Wait, you're serious, aren't you? What is it with you people? You walk in. Want to be combatants, and your entrails end up decorating my red room. All right, it's your funeral. Welcome to the arena, you filthy pit dog. You're free to fight so long as you know the rules of competition. Now let me give you your battle raiment. It's the uniform of all arena combatants. Do you want a light raiment or a heavy raiment? Light, please. A light raiment, huh? You sure? I figured you for the heavy raiment type. You know, hide behind a skin of steel. Hmm. Okay then, here. Put that on, see if it fits okay. When you're ready for a match, I'll be waiting. You want to fight, you talk to me. All right then? All right. Get a move on. I'll have to wait. Hey there. Hail, friend. I don't believe I've ever seen you down here in the Bloodworks before. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Agranok Gromalag. Most people just call me the Grey Prince. It's kind of silly, I know, but the people of Cyrodiil need heroes. I'm more than happy to oblige. He's ah, such a good guy. so you're an arena combatant. It's always good to meet a fellow warrior. Especially one who wasn't here just to kill the Grand Champion. <laughs> Ray Prince. Yes, it's what everyone calls me. I guess I'm partly to blame. I have never made it a secret that I'm actually only half orc. I am a lord's son, yet I've been denied the noble privilege to which I'm entitled. So I have become the Grey Prince, noble in my own right. Still, if I could prove who I really am and show the world that an orc can be noble in blood as well as deed, maybe, yes, you could help me. You might be able to help. Tell me more. I grew up here in the Imperial City, but I was born elsewhere. My mother was a servant in the employ of Lord Leviticus and resided at his fortress. Lady Leviticus was a shrew of a woman. The Lord and my mother grew close and ultimately fell in love. I was the result of their union. When the lady learned of my birth, she was furious and threatened to kill both my mother and me. So we fled, leaving my claim to nobility behind. Please go on. My mother died recently. Before she passed, she gave me this key, and told me it would unlock the truth at the place of my birth, Crowhaven. Crowhaven is a ruined fort far to the west of here. I'd go myself, but my training regiment doesn't allow for the luxury of such an excursion. Oh, I forgot. Crowhaven's really my friend, far away. You must travel to Crowhaven and use the key to unlock whatever it is that holds the proof of my birthright. Find this proof and return it to me, and I'll share with you some of my finest combat techniques. Trust me, 
You can't learn these moves in a book. I will, I will do that. But you know what? I will not be doing the arena yet. I think it'd be worse. Um, going for the Grey Prince quest. It's like down this way. It's by Anvil. This is pretty far away, but if we go to Wayne and Priory, and start that, then we'll start going towards the direction. So let's go. You know, I had considered back, um, like, probably halfway through the summer, different types of schedules for the fall. Like, when I would schedule- when I would stream and whatnot, and I'm finding that streaming during the weekdays is still good, even if, like, my... even if, uh, oh, hi. I don't know whose horse this is because I've seen this horse like numerous times. And I think what's his face is around here. He has the same name as me. We have the same name. Where is he? Where is Shady Sam? There he is. You need something special? Check out my wares. You won't find this stuff at your local general store, that's for damn sure. Yeah, give me your stuff. Let's do business. Mm, I'll haggle a little bit. Just a little bit. Give me, give me, I let give that me. go too cheaply. Well, Tell good for me. Tell your friends about me. Maybe, if I have any friends. Come see me anytime, friend. I'm here day or night. Yeah, I think if we follow this road, we'll be good. saying oh i was talking about my schedule i had considered things like streaming on like the weekends instead and whatnot but i feel like streaming on the weekdays is better because then i have um well i don't have any classes on fridays so I would just be streaming on those days but also it's just nice to have those rest days on saturdays and sundays so, I'm pretty pleased with my choice of schedule. Alright. We need to go to Kuro. I think it's this way. Yeah. Lady. Its scent is unfamiliar. What can I do for you? Who are you? The Fighters Guild is recruiting again. Not a bad way to make some money if you've got the stones for it. True. Take care. Very true, very true. Yeah, 
Yeah, I've considered all sorts of different schedules, like over the weekend, like Friday through Sunday, or like, I don't know, just randomly anytime I could. I've, I had even considered just not streaming during the fall at all. But, nope, I really missed doing this. <laughs> I had only been gone for two weeks and I already missed it. I really enjoy streaming and, and it's really nice. But there is such a such a sheer contrast between how sociable I am on stream versus how sociable I am in person. I am an incredibly shy person, but um, I, I feel like people would probably assume that to be the case considering that I am a VTuber. Which, that's not necessarily true. I don't mind sharing my face, but I suppose my biggest issues with... Um, interacting with people in person is that I never know I, I have such a hard time telling when is appropriate to speak and that's always been a big issue for me it's it's, it's an issue with me and both of my parents we never know when is appropriate to speak like how to tell when someone's done talking because it feels like other people are really good at it. Where to Ash? Yeah, let's take a little detour. Actually, I want to go up first. And that was, that's just like, it kind of was a bit of a slap in the face, uh, when I started back in my classes. Cause like, even though there were some familiar faces, I'm still a little too shy to talk. And I feel like most people don't really get that from me. Like, I guess it's just cause of my general appearance and the way I carry myself. People tend to cluck me as more, like, intimidating or something. Which, to be fair, I do have quite quite a bad case of resting bitch face, but I am incredibly shy and very, very, um, sensitive. <laughs> I just, I just, my appearance and my general personality tend to contrast a little bit. Good guy. Ooh. Why are there dead goblins here? Who killed you? I'm starting to get a bit heavy. I don't think I'll run into any more uh, towns, or not towns, but any more like places directly on this path. So once we do this, I shall head straight for Coral and I'll probably stop at a shop before going to visiting Joffrey. And when I do that, I'll probably end stream there. I'll sell my stuff and then go visit Joffrey and talk to him and then off I go. And tomorrow we will not be playing Oblivion, we will be playing something else. We shall play- we shall be playing Celeste, which I've never played before. Oh. 
happened? <laughs> oh, uh oh. There he is. <laughs> gotcha. I might start working on some more emotes in preparation for when I reached affiliate. I might remake some of them as well. I'll probably, I'll probably keep my uh, first emotes on my Discord server though. Speaking of which, um, if you do the whole exclamation Discord thing in, in chat, you'll notice that uh, I don't actually have a link, but I do uh, share that, um, hey, you should go visit my Instagram for the regularly updated link, because I update it on my story every Sunday and add it to the- Ow! My ass! I, I add it to uh, my highlight Discord. Oh, hi! But that's also the same highlight where I add my, whoopsie, my schedule. So that's why I update it every Sunday because I put it alongside that's the wrong key. The the arena raiment isn't as good as the Ow! It isn't as good as the light vest that I found. Got him right in the knee. Huh? Oh! Sneaky! I got him right in the thigh, I guess. I don't think I've ever been here before. Maybe. Some of these places just kind of all look the same. Oh, hi! Honestly, really excited to play Celeste tomorrow because, like, I know it's a very difficult game. I'm well aware of that, but I like I like any sort of platforming type game, and I feel like I'd be fairly decent at it. I I my reputation as a mid gamer is funny, but there are certain games, certain types of games that I'm a little better at than others. And I feel like I'm fairly decent at platformers, especially in Metroidvanias, because I did- I feel like I did really well in, a uh, Hollow Knight. Ooh. Where? Where are you? There you are. <laughs> I thought I was gonna miss. Oopsie. I shot you both in the same arm. How beautiful is that? Oh! <laughs> nice. <clears throat> but I think once I hit um, 50, I have another goal in mind already.
because I've started on something. And it's it's early in the works, but I am I am excited for it. But I think um, probably around the time I hit affiliate, uh, I may possibly switch from followers to subs, but that just depends. I should probably keep uh, my goals to followers rather than subs for that. But, um, I shall be right back. Hold on. I have to- I have to mess with OBS through my phone while I play Oblivion because I have no way of tabbing out of the game. But I shall be right back. Oh, that's- that- did, did I not transition properly? Hold on, that's supposed to be 300, right? 300 milliseconds, hold on. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I don't know why it was set to 50 milliseconds instead of 300. I don't know, I'll be right back.
I have brought a guest. Saturn is with me. <laughs> Saturn. And my boy! What? <laughs> he slipped! Your toes! Ow! Murder toes. Hold on, I'm trying to turn on my heating pad. There we go. Normally, I just slap it with my foot and that works. But it's a bit hard to do with slippers on. Don't do that. Don't mess with that. Alright, hold on. Here we go. We're back. Maybe. Oh shit, there's a goblin down there. I could have died. I didn't even pause the game. I just left. Saturn, stop it. There's two goblins. There's only one way for you to reach me, and it's your demise. Oh, shit. Rats? Rats? Where are the rats? You can't do shit. Shit! I almost fell. Saturn, stop. Hold on. I have an idea. Normally, when rats are in cages like this, they don't really respond to this kind of stuff. But I guess they're just kind of like, not like the ones in the tutorial cave. Maybe they forgot to program that setting again. Hi, Saturn. There's another one. Oi! There we go. Yes, please sit down. Let's sleep. I want to see Lucien Lachance. You sleep rather soundly for a murderer. That's good. You'll need a clear conscience for what I'm about to propose. I I don't know which dialogue option I want to do for for scream. I think I'll just do the first one. <gasps> oh. Who are you? I am Lucian Lachance, a speaker for the Dark Brotherhood, and you. You are a killer, taker of life, a harvester of souls. Your work, your death craft, pleases the Night Mother. And so, I come to you with an offering, an opportunity to join our rather unique family. Please continue, Mr. Lachance. Ah, I find your etiquette refreshing. Now please, listen carefully. On the green road to the north of Breville lies the Inn of Ill Omen. There you will find a man named Rufio. It's voice cracked. I've never Kill noticed him, that before. And your initiation into the Dark Brotherhood will be complete. Do this, and the next time you sleep in a location I deem secure, I, I will reveal myself once more, bearing the love of your new family. Rufio will die by my hand. Excellent. Now please, accept this token from the Dark Brotherhood. It is a virgin blade and thirsts for blood. May it serve your endeavors well. Now, I bid you farewell. I do hope we'll meet again soon. Dark Brotherhood. Have you not heard of the Dark Brotherhood? Of the remorseless guild of paid assassins and homicidal cutthroats? Join us 
and you'll find the Dark Brotherhood to be all that and so much more. We are, more than anything, a union of like-minded individuals. We kill for profit, for enjoyment, and for the glory of the Dread Father Sithis. We are family with bonds forged in blood and death. <laughs> I would not be surprised if you heard Saturn every once in a while. Night Mother! We praise our unholy matron. From her shadowed womb we were born. From her breast we suckle malice and pain. She loves her children, you see. This voice actor, I don't know his name, but he's like probably the best in this game. He's really, really good. Cause like, cause like that's the general like male imperial voice. But like he does uh, Lucian's voice so differently, and it's great. Know that Rufio is old and weak and sleeps his days away. You could kill him before he even has a chance to wake, if you so choose. Yes, I am a speaker. A representative of the Dark Brotherhood. My voice is the voice of the Black Hand, our organization's ruling body. One of my duties is to find exceptional individuals such as yourself and offer a place within our family. And like, it's so funny clicking rumors because he just defaults to the regular voice. There's been some terrible trouble at the chapel in Anvil. All of Dubella's priests and priestesses murdered. Because, <laughs> like, I remember being a kid, and the first time I clicked that, because I was like, oh, I wonder what rumors sound like in his voice. And then it was that voice. I was like, oh, I didn't even know it was that guy. It's silly. Your path is clear. Send Rufio to his death, and the Dark Brotherhood will embrace you as family. All right. Bye-bye. Have a good day. Don't get killed. But you can't be killed until a certain point. Ow! Oops. Many. I just want some of the arrows I shot. That's all. Oh, I didn't even notice. I forgot. But I think that's it. I don't think there's anything else here. Maybe. Maybe. I need to check. Let's see. Nope. Oh, that's it. He's still here. I have nothing more to say. We shall speak again only after Rufio lies dead. All right, you're stuck though. Well, you won't be stuck when I'm when I leave. But that's really funny. The pathfinding's a bit broken in this area. There he is. There's nothing I've missed here, so we can just leave. You need to like move your feet. Hi. Your money or your life. Take it from me if you can. Actually, 
That's the way this one prefers it. You are nothing! I wasn't expecting the bandit. I was just adjusting my boy. Because his feet were digging into my leg. Almost there. There's a deal farm. Oh, this is the farm with the, the trolls, I think. Oh, but you can't do anything with it until you activate the quest line. Or no, it's goblins. I think it was goblins that had like taken over the farm. Melon. I feel like I can keep my focus better on the on the quests at hand while I'm streaming. I just feel like it's a bit uh, more difficult to stay on one singular track if I'm like just playing by myself. There's just something nice about just having other people watching. Yes, I must see Joffre. Normally, like, what are you doing here? I'm Joffrey. Brother Joffrey. What do you want? Brought you the Amulet of Kings. This cannot be. No one but the Emperor is permitted to handle the amulet. Let me see it. By the Nine. This is the Amulet of Kings. Who are you? How did you get this? What do you know of the Emperor's death? As unlikely as your story words. sounds, I believe you. Close Only shut the, the jaws of oblivion. Septim could have brought you to me carrying the amulet of kings. Close shut the jaws of oblivion. His meaning is unclear to me as well. The emperor seemed to perceive some threat from the demonic world of oblivion. The prince of destruction, Merun's Dagon, is one of the lords of oblivion. But the mortal world is protected from the Daedra of oblivion by magical barriers. How can Oblivion threaten us, then? I'm not sure. Only the Emperors truly understand the meaning behind the rituals of coronation. The Amulet of Kings is ancient. Saint Alicia herself received it from the gods. It is a holy relic of great power. When an Emperor is crowned, he uses the Amulet to light the dragon fires at the Temple of the One in the Imperial City. With the Emperor dead and no new heir crowned, the dragon fires in the Temple will be dark for the first time in centuries. It may be that the dragon fires protected us from a threat that only the Emperor was aware of. The Emperor asked me to find his son. I am one of the few who know of his existence. Many years ago, I served as captain of Uriel's bodyguards, the Blades. One night, Uriel called me into his private chambers. A baby boy lay sleeping in a basket. Uriel told me to deliver him somewhere safe. He never told me anything else about the baby, but I knew it was his son. From time to time, he would ask about the child's progress. Now it seems that this illegitimate son is the heir to the Septim throne, 
if he yet lives. Where can I find Uriel's son? His name is Martin. He serves Akatosh in the chapel in the city of Kvac, south of here. You must go to Kvac and find him at once. If the enemy is aware of his existence, as seems likely, he is in terrible danger. And please, Martin. let me know if there's anything you need. My resources here are limited, but I will help in any way I can. We are of kings. It will be safest here with me. When you return with Martin, we will figure out our next move. Assistance. I keep a few things here in my chest to resupply traveling blades. Help yourself to whatever you need. Well, thank you. Oh, oh. oh shit. <laughs> Hold on. Forgot to put that on. Let's see. I can drop. Oh, no, drop that. I can drop that too. There we go. Your first priority now. Sh yeah, 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 yeah. Boris. One of the youngest blades ever to serve in the Emperor's personal guard. He's young. I am glad to hear that he survived. <laughs> But I fear he will take the Emperor's death particularly hard. Yeah, dragon fires. The coronation of each new Emperor is sealed when he uses the Amulet of Kings to light the dragon fires in the Temple of the One. The dragon fires of Akatosh remain lit until the death of the Emperor. His successor then lights them anew upon ascending to the throne. With Emperor Uriel dead and no successor crowned, the Temple of the One will be dark for the first time in centuries. That's true. Elder Council. The Elder Council rules in the Emperor's absence by ancient tradition. Chancellor Akato heads the Elder Council and is the closest thing the Empire has to a leader right now. But the Blades answer only to the Emperor, of course. We are not an arm of the government. Waste no time. You must find Martin before the enemy Soup. Does. That's soup. I actually think it was soup. I guess it's because of the way the bowl looks. But anyway, let's go in coral and sell some stuff. And then I shall take my leave. It's kind of nice running around. There's the the repair guy. Hey, what's new with you? How I goes it? There were some Hello. goblins around here recently. Awful creatures. He just killed the fighters killed. I don't need those. Hello, I don't think we've met. Are you new in town? Yes, I am. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. I'm always glad to meet someone new. Welcome. I'm sure my mother would be glad to meet you as well. Have you seen Vallis Odile recently? Spends all day in the tavern since his boys left. My mother owns this shop. I don't really Please understand the point of this. Only the finest wares to buy. Yeah, 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 yeah. What can I interest buy my you stuff. in? You drive a hard bargain.
That see that seems a fair. There, I can start that quest. Ah. Uh, That see a uh, good that's more than I That's more than I'd usually take the shovel. I do not want that shovel. Why do I have a shovel? <laughs> I don't want the torch either. Get that out of here. Thank you for your business. Alright. Bye. Goodbye. Wait, I hold hope on. I can Let's get to training. training. Pay attention, and you can learn a lot. Yeah. Let's see if we can't. Now I can level up. I'm willing to teach. Yes. Thank you. Farewell. Let's get some sleep. An honor to serve you. Give me bed. I have a. The... Thank you. Bye. Bye. Now then. You've ascended to level three. You realize that you are catching on the, to the secret of success. It's just a matter of concentration. All right then. What is it, pond scum? Oh, shut up! All right, we auto saved. All right then. That is all for today. I've got shit to do. I've got, a, I've got an exam to finish. So, as always, I hope you have a good day. Good night. Good night, whatever. Uh, and, as always, farewell. <laughs>